What's good, YouTube? It's Sos. Money is say You already know the vibes. You feel me? We back with another reaction. Now, my son Hassan been getting some heat, bro. Like, you know, I've been doing other content and all that. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? I did a vlog. I dropped a Q&A. So, if y'all didn't see those, y'all need to go check out those videos for real. And smash the like button on those videos and share it. You know what I'm saying? It's free, you heard? You feel me? Yo, so look, boom. Yo, Hassan been, ca been catching some um some crazy sh uh some crazy strays, bro. Like this dude ten toes down is violating my nigga. Like, bro, this is the title of ten toes down. It says, "Did Hassan Campbell soup snitch on Bronx River killer?" Like, bro, what? That's a outrageous. Title, you feel me? So yeah, we about to react to that. Before I press play on this video, though, subscribe to my channel. You heard? Put your chest in it. You know what I'm saying? Smash that like button. Turn on your post notifications so y'all can get notified every time I drop a video. The post notifications is the bell, guys. All right, it's very, very serious that y'all turn on your post notifications. You're not getting my videos, okay? I'm not, my videos is not getting notified to my subscribers. So make sure y'all turn on your uh, the bell. All right. So yeah, so let's get let's get into it, bro. Son is talking crazy, all right? The title or the thumbnail is um Bird Harlem Leggings. Um 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 China Brim, Hassan Campbell, and the clown. The clown represents them all. That's what it is. The clown represents them all. Damn, bro. He put a clown on a thumbnail? I didn't see that. I gotta check that out. That's old D, bro. China Brim was just saying he was just saying that uh ten toes down, um, that he be coming to Brooklyn all the time. When they see they just talk, they just run their mouth. Y'all know China Brim don't come to Brooklyn. They killed your man. They killed your homeboy, your best friend, your childhood. Damn. You might as well say they killed your brother. They killed your brother. <laughs> Yo, those is fighting words right there, bro. What? Yo, let me tell you something. This Ten Toes guy right here, I did like maybe like two two videos on him probably. You know what I'm saying? And yo, he give it up, bro. He don't hold back, bro. You feel me? He gonna that man. This man gonna speak his mind. You heard? Like he said, China don't come to Brooklyn, bro, because his man's got clapped. His best friend, his brother, that's tough. That's OD right there. Rest in peace. Rest in peace to Jive Turkey. Yo, at least he said rest in peace, though. Because a lot of people, nowadays, the youngest be like, yo, I'm smoking on your, your, the, your day, you heard? That's how they do, you feel me? But they killed him. This nigga didn't come to the funeral. He didn't say nothing to the mama. He didn't send condolences. He didn't make a video. Not going to the funeral. I know I keep pausing, but not going to the funeral is crazy. What? Yo, he didn't uh, let balloons go. He didn't do nothing. That's how you know it's some suckers. If Harlem Leggings got murdered today, if that dirty dry lip living in his baby mom's crib with the <laughs> old furniture, nah. if that dirt, uh, the, the, a linebacker, five sacks? Nah, dirty dry lip is crazy, bro. That That's very insulting. That ass and that real nigga move. Yeah, making me feel a little dry right yeah, now. No. <laughs> His girl got five sacks. Oh yeah, when I when I come back, when I, when, part two of this video, y'all. Just remember this: when I do part two of this video, I'm gonna be showing y'all some more pictures. Harlem, you try to get rid of those goddamn Facebook pictures with you dancing with your mother. You feminine sucker. That is a feminine mother. I don't care how tough he talking all that. You feminine dancing ass motherfucker. You thought you got rid of them Facebook videos and all that before I got a hold of it. Yo, all y'all done. Hassan Campbell talk all of this, that, and that, and disrespect woman. I'm gonna I'm do the remix to it. I'm gonna put his girl back up there again. I'm gonna put both his baby moms up there. And his little, little, uh, trans -am. I've got a Bro, problem what? that I'm pretty sure you can. What the? <laughs> Yo, these old heads be wilder. I'm gonna put up his trans -am son. Everybody, what he said? Everybody could get it now, man. I got my ACGs on. Like, Hold on, we gotta go back, bro. Disrespect woman. I'm gonna I'm do the remix to it. I'm gonna put his girl back up there again. I'm gonna put both of his baby moms up there and his little, little, uh, Trans Sam. Bring it back. I'm gonna 
put up his Tram Zam son. Everybody going up there. Anybody could get it now, man. I got my Yo, he going crazy right now. Like to the point where he dropped his phone, son. My ACG's on. Anybody can get it. So just remember. ACG's on. Nah, we not jacking ACG's. You lost me with the ACG's, bro. Like I know we was we was rocking those OD, but like we not rocking ACG's. I swear, let me tell you something. If you got on a pair of ACG's, bro, listen, I'm not knocking, I'm not knocking nothing. All right, because they used to be, you know, very popping, especially in New York. But like ACG's now is like for work attire. You feel me? Like if you work in like FedEx, UPS. Amazon, the mailman, the, your local neighborhood mailman. Yeah, I'm be wearing ACGs, but I'm not rocking no fucking ACGs. I'm sorry, yo. We throwing the Thames on and calling it a day. You heard. Remember, <laughs> tune in tomorrow. I'm gonna be going live again. See what it is is with these dudes, right? They really think they lit and they buying views and they doing all this shit, right? But ten, I treat YouTube like I treat my woman. I up them slow. I uck him. I uck him real slow. I do it slow. You know? I do it slow. I came, I came to be the main, the center of attention, the voice of the streets. Uh in time. It took time for me to blow like this. You know what I'm saying? When I go out, I, I got numerous uh 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 large amounts of people who run down on 10. Yo, tell them what up, yo, yo, I join you, I love you, yo, you official this. That's because I'm Hey yo, and I'm just gonna throw it out there that it's not my it's not my video that's glitching. This is literally was on his live that's messing up like that really outside that's because i'm really doing something in communities i'm not talking about my community i'm talking about everywhere i'm, I'm ready to go wherever people call me i'll pull up i'll do whatever they ask me to do in reference to helping or just having my presence there these dudes if y'all look at it man let me tell you something none of them live in new york no more they all talk about new york beach jeez he said none of them live in new york bro y'all over here chatting about the city and you not living out here no more Got better life, bro. <laughs> Think about it, yo. They all have New York information and New York beef, and none of them live in New York. These dudes are straight up informants. Now it ain't no conspiracy theory with me. My mind is telling me now these dudes have to be some type of informants or something. It's something there. China Brim lives in Florida. Harlem Legend lives in North Carolina, Pennsylvania, wherever it's at, but he's gone. Uh, Hassan Campbell lives upstate, and they know all the information in the 411 and what's going on. How is that? Y'all not even here, and I'm yeah. here, and I don't be knowing it. Yo, bro, I'm not even going to lie, bro. It's entertaining watching this. Like, like all these dudes, they OGs, you feel me? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, I'm young, you know what I'm saying? These are OGs, you feel me? And um, you feel me? Like, I don't know. It's, it's <laughs> It's entertaining to 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 watch them. <laughs> I mean, it is like I've I've been watching Hassan Campbell for a minute. Y'all know that, you know. I'm just starting to watch Ten Toes Down videos, so we really, but we really about to be doing a lot of reactions in because I never really noticed how funny he is. Like this, he's really funny. You feel me? So I gotta start doing some reactions on him too. Hopefully, this video do well. You feel me? Like, I definitely about to show love to Ten Toes Down channel. Well, you know what I'm saying. Um, Hassan, we've been rocking on with Hassan channel, um, for a minute, you know, so, you know, we about to mix it up, you feel me? But this, yo, he's funny, like, the information, who they source, it has to be the police, man. Y'all think hip hop police is fake? They got a club uptown in the Bronx called Salsa Con Fuego, and Salsa Con Fuego, one of the Salsa first original hip hop police is the head security dude in there. Wait until I get him to do an interview. Y'all can bet it's gonna be some shit because when they say hip hop police, he is really and that shit is real. He said, Yo, he's the first hip hop police. I'm like, so that really was real. That's what y'all was called. Yeah, hip hop police. We went looking for rappers and seen information we can get and all of that. Now what? they really have you two police. No, yo, no making yo. Now I have YouTube police. <laughs> Yo, YouTube police is crazy, gang. Like, up stuff. 
nothing. Yo. There are you two police, <laughs> and guess what? Them police just sit in the cut, and they just wait. And they don't stand by. Nothing really goes on on YouTube, except these dudes divulging information. But nothing serious to where they can. All right, what are you talking but about? What? Just think about this though, right? I did a video about these young brothers, these little, the little young gang in Brooklyn, the young boys that got locked up. All these little young gangs and the police is on these people's tails. Look at where everybody's getting locked up at. It's either in Brooklyn or in the Bronx. That's a fact. China Brim, Hassan Campbell. Don't I'm not on no conspiracy theory shit. These dudes is really hip hop police, man. I'm telling you. I mean, you two police. That's a reach, man. Come on, seriously. China Mac and Hassan is YouTube police, bro. If anything, if you want to call YouTube police, you need to be saying, um, what's his name? 1090 Jake. I think his name is 1090 Jake. Yeah. That's YouTube police for real. My son goes through everybody's paperwork. You cannot hide a thing from him. You feel me? Like, seriously, like, that's the, he's YouTube police, bro. Like, if, if, if that's what you want to call it. Hassan, I feel like he just he just he just reports on the news. You know what I'm saying? You don't see I've never seen Hassan go dig up some paperwork. You feel me? And, and put it on the screen and react to it like that. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Y'all could let me know in the comments if, if I'm wrong or not. But you know what I'm saying? Like, and if he has done it, like he I don't I, I know for sure he don't do it like on almost every video, like 1090 Jake do. He do it on every video. He's pulling up people paperwork. That's YouTube police. You feel me? That's the definition of YouTube police. If we want, if we want to go that route. Now, me, I don't think 10 1090 Jake is YouTube police. Nah, that's nigga YouTube police, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> they don't live in New York. They don't come in New York. They don't know nothing about New York. Nothing. And they know all the information of what's going on and all the gangs and who with it. They know all the young boys' names. How you know little 17 and 18 year old little young boys' names and you ain't been in New York in the last four or five years? Come on, man. I'm not buying it. Y'all can buy it if you want. Now, when it comes to Hassan Campbell, right, everything I'm talking about today, I'm going to put it on part two. Just remember, tomorrow's part two. I might make a part five, because that's how much these dudes been running their mouth and telling. I rock with all y'all that's in the chat. Salute, b -Ville. On top of that, before I get into the Hassan Campbell, I'm, 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 I got to finish this dude, these two these two little uh, lovers off. Uh, uh, Ashford and Simpson. I got to finish off Af Ashford and Simpson first. Let me finish off Ashford nah, and Simpson, nah, we don't and then we're going to get to them. it. Let's go to Hassan. So he said, see Franklin. See Franklin ain't nowhere near me. He ain't nowhere near around me. Nowhere near me. Who the fuck is I never get Franklin? stabbed up, cut, jumped, beat up, nothing in the joint. These dudes really got jail stories where they got beat up. China Brim really got beat up in jail. Hassan Campbell really got beat up in jail. He says it out of his own mouth. They all say it out their own mouth. Harlem legend really was a suspect for tree jumping. Harlem, Harlem Legacy is really a suspect for tree jumping. This ain't no make believe shit. I'm not the one that put it out there. Somebody else put it out there. Then if it's out there, that means it's true because that's what they make. Whatever information out there makes it true. So you mean to tell me that 10 toes down is out? Shopify point of sale makes it easy to start and grow your retail business. What? Nah, I ain't gonna lie. This, this live is pretty juicy. I probably should. I, I, can, I can walk outside. I can walk outside. I really can walk out here. I can walk out here and be free. These niggas, are, these dudes are still in jail. Like, come on, I'm not living like that. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not in jail no more. I'm not. Yo, come on. What happened? Dudes who talk about was allowing Bam Bada to pork chop him. No. Hassan Campbell got pork chopped. I, I didn't say that. He said it. he he got pork chopped. Hassan Campbell sat down with me. Told me to record it. I got the video. Y'all know, y'all know. I, I just put the clip up. Y'all know I got the whole video. Said this is exclusive. This is gonna be exclusive. And then he get up on on 050 and talk about yeah he has some gadget like he didn't know he was being recorded. You sat down with me. You asked me to come up there with bam. You dirt bum pork chop. I'm putting everybody. I'm really make you mad now. I'm putting your other baby mamas up there too. You really gonna be mad when they get a load of them. All of that disrespect and how you disrespect women and ugly bitch and all of this and your fat bitch. Wait till they get a load of your other baby mother. Oh my God. They're going to be like, I know this old train smoking looking lady. Can't, yeah. Yeah. Like Jennifer under the truck. 
Yeah, yeah. That's the other bird. The baby Trey mama. smoking like baby mom. Yeah, because it looked like somebody ran her over. <laughs> this dude got up here. This dude got up here and did all this talking. All this, we bring out all this gun shit. Man, shut up, nigga. You pussy. You already know. When the, if I ain't never come out on this YouTube thing and never did all of this, it's where you, I forced you to start talking back. You would have continued praising me. You would have continued calling me, asking me and Troy. Yo, when I can hang out with you, man, your dudes be popping bottles. Your dudes be hanging out. Yeah, yeah. You wanted me to be a security and hang out in the club like you did my man Rich and, 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 and Daniel. Coward. This, I know that ain't real, Hassan. And they're saying, where you at right now? We can brawl hand in hand. You know you can't, you can't cross the scratch line. You cannot come to New York. You can't come to Jersey. Yo, so Hassan was in the comments? Yo, I missed this shit, bro. What? And, and if it's the... You see where I'm at? I'm in BJ. I'm in BJ's right now. See, the thing about it with these dudes right here, man, they don't know about wins and losses. They don't know about wins and losses. They don't know about that, man. All they know about is losses. They don't know how to win. Hassan Campbell's whole life, he's been losing. His firstborn, a boy, came out. Trail Sam! Bring it back! Quick! <laughs> Yo, what the... <laughs> did he just call him a, a trans... What did he say? Set? Bro, what? Your first point? Your, what, fellas, come on. To my, to my men out there. To my men out there. Because I, I can understand where the psychological effect comes in at this sucker, where, 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 where it starts at. It starts from Bam. But before that, he said it started with his brother, who was touching him first in the household when he was like about five. That's out of his mouth. I'm only repeating what he said. I'm not making nothing up. This is what Hassan said. At five, his brother was already touching him. And as he got older, that's from Bam. So he was already broken in, as he said. And then his first boy. Did he say that? I never, I never heard her song like that. Well, let me know in the comments. He said that his brother did that. Come out, just what he is. I gonna hold you. I've did, I've done at least hundred and seventy some uh, videos of Hassan Camp reactions, bro. And I, don't, I never heard him say anything about his brother. His brother, though. Mm. You now you would feel if your first born come out like that. You trying to portray yourself to be a man, a real. <laughs> you want to be a real. <laughs> Huh? And the first one come out like that? You gonna be upset too. My first one is a train. Trans Am. <laughs> what? Yo, why he Trans Am with the stick? <laughs> why he keep saying it like that though? Maybe okay. So what you can't say that on YouTube or something like? Or he just that's just his way of saying it. His first one is a Trans Am with the stick. He's a stick shift Trans Am. Then the next one come out. Not, can't get right. Then the next one can't get right. Come on, that's gonna make you be like, ah, bro. Did he just say stick is crazy, son? Yo, nah, we got a lot of a lot more reactions, that, bro. I ain't worth shit. Yeah, that's why I am. Yeah, uh huh. Yeah, I'm a rat. Look, look, look I'm a rat. <laughs> Who in jail? Who in jail behind ten? Yeah. Who in jail behind ten toes down? I'm ten toes, man. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. That's 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 crazy. He, you know what I'm saying? He said, "I'm a rat." Who's who's in jail behind ten toes, bro? Like nobody. So you can't you can't call him a rat. Yeah, they can try to they can try to uh 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 put the kid on a yeah, he's a man you can trans transcend. He's a man you transition without oil. He ain't got no oil. Yeah. Bro, he said a manual tr transition with no oil. Yo, the the Let me say. the analogy, bro, no is crazy. But listen, man, Hassan Campbell got the nerve to come up here for all of these years to brag about having a murder charge. He put some paperwork up there about him being locked up for murder and all this other stuff. I don't even know. I never even seen the paperwork. I don't know about none of that. I don't know about the paperwork. All I know is that I'm in the mix of stuff now in the video and uh, uh, China Birmingham is using my video to talk about what he said. He said out of his own mouth that Nudie, the Bronx River gangster, him and Myra killed somebody in the building in Backspin. This is what Hassan Campbell is saying. 
and they put that body on her song camera. Now let me tell you what happened, okay? Because this ain't no this ain't no games and all that, man. Little stupid ass lanes. They never been through nothing. Her song Campbell. Know what Nudie and Myron did with a, 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 a the, the murder. Her song Campbell is running around telling people, yo, you know, you know I killed the niggas in that building, right? Yo, you know I killed the niggas in that building, right? Drop that body, right? Yo, you know I dropped those bodies up there, right? Her son is running around Bronx River telling people that he caught that body. And what do they do? The word get around to the real rats in the hood and they lock his dumb ass up. They lock them up. They lock us all up for murder. Hassan Campbell really was locked. He didn't have nothing. He was locked up for that. Same thing was it with the drip and all the rest of them. Rats. Why nobody asking the question, when you was locked up for that murder, how did you get out? He's going to say, I went to trial and all this. Okay, so you went to trial. So that means you have transcripts. Where are your transcripts? Because you can guarantee this. That nudie body. He told on that body. All he tell y'all is that he beat two bodies. He never tell y'all how he beat it. Wait a minute, bro. Oh, y'all. Nudie killed them people and he got locked up. Nudie set me up for a body. No, you ain't going to put that on Nudie because Nudie dead. Nudie ain't set you up for nothing. Nudie didn't care nothing about you, you dirt bomb bum. Nudie was gangster in the hood. See, y'all got to pay attention to what he says. I can't break it down right now because I don't have the video to show you. Yo, is this true? Yo, I'm like blown away by this right now, bro. You feel me? You, you see that got quiet. You know what I'm saying? Yo, y'all let me know in the comments, yo. Y'all think this story is real? Yo, I got to go on my computer. The song said, him and Nudie was at war. Right? You got to listen to the video. I'm telling you to go over to China Brim and look at the video. Because I don't even remember where the video was on my channel. I got the original. I got to I gotta upload it and play it for y'all. He said that he was at war with Bronx River with Nudie. Nudie had two guns on him, patted him down. This nigga had a gun with no bullets. What war are you in? What bullets did he have? He didn't have no bullets. Same way with bullets, Gotti. That's a no bullet right there. That's no bullets. <laughs> Maybe he didn't have bullets. Yo, I'm not going to hold you. He's destroying these guys, bro. So I, he must have beef with bullets, Gotti, as well, bro. With him yet. If he had bullets, Gotti, he would have said he had bullets. But he got a gun with no bullets. Stop right there. He said, I got a gun that Bam Bada gave the crazy legs, and I got it in a 38 with no bullets. <laughs> what war are you in with no bullets? He said he had that 38 that he got from crazy legs, and he was looking for. Uh, yo, I ain't gonna hold you. Ladies and gentlemen, please stay. We might have to get the whole live. We might have to react to the whole live. I might have to part this up. You feel me? Like, slice it, slice this up real quick, bro. And pull it out in front on Nudie like he got a gun with bullets. Nudie caught up with his ass, patted him down, made him shit on himself. And he said, after that, that's when I turned on and I started getting busy. Stop right there. In that same story, you just said you was getting busy already. Before that, because you was going to war with Nudie, you was getting busy. And then you say, after that, that's when I turned on and started getting busy. But then in another video, you got to remember what Ten is saying. And y'all can go back through this when I come back tomorrow and show y'all the videos that I'm talking about. He's in a video with me and with Bam. Not Bam Bada, but Bam Bam. He said, he didn't turn on until after Bam Bam and another dude. I don't remember the dude's name. It's in the video. 
used to tell niggas to leave him alone. And that's when he started to turn up after that. Is there is there a homicide arrest on Hassan's rap sheet? This is the thing right here, guys. There is no homicide arrest on his rap sheet. His, like right today, you go look up his rap sheet, there's no homicide on there. He got papers from before when that nudie homicide was on there. That's the history of before from murders people court that he went bragging about that he never even had no parts of. These y'all, y'all, these, these people look crazy, man. Nah, I, I ain't gonna, gonna lie. Going. I gotta stop the video right here. He, I'm not gonna hold you. He's really spilling all the beans, bro. Um, yeah, for real, cause I'm I never heard the story before. Are you feel me? I never really did a lot of videos on ten tones, but I think we need to have to. I think we have to. I think we gotta start doing videos on him. So I'm gonna stop it right here. Um, I know this is pretty long, but you know what I'm saying. I wasn't expecting this live to be juicy like how it was, you feel me? But I appreciate y'all watching this video. Y'all let me know in the comments what y'all think about it. Before y'all head out, though, subscribe to my channel. You heard, put your chest in it. You know what I'm saying? Smash that like button. Turn on your post notifications, which is the bell, so y'all can get notified every time I drop a video. And damn, I'll see y'all on the next one. Let's get it.